Howdy guys. It's been a very busy day, so I'm getting a very late start. So, I am going to make pizza burgers tonight with fried potatoes. So over in my black pan there is potatoes frying. I've got onions in here. <coughs> so what I'm going to do is I'll get everything started. And then when I get everything else going, then I'll bring it back. So, I'm going to put butter in there. I'm going to also use my own home canned mushrooms. And I keep thinking of more ideas, and I'm like, it's going to be too full, but that's okay. <laughs> that's okay. Alright, and I'm going to use some of my canned peppers here that I have. I'm going to chop them up really good. So I hope everybody's had an amazing week. It's Friday, it's Friday, it's Friday. Isn't that nice? My husband has to work all weekend. <laughs> so tomorrow, after I get some stuff done, um, I'll probably be doing some canning videos and some other kind of prepping videos that I wanted to share with everybody. So I'm going to add that to it. And then I think I'm going to put pepperoni too because what's a pizza without pepperoni, right? At least on mine anyway. I've always ordered the same thing. Pan pepperoni mushrooms my whole life. Because I'm just weird that way. But what I'm going to do instead of putting big pieces like this on the, the um, hamburger, I'm going to actually fry mine in with the mushrooms and the onions so it's all kind of blended together and I think that'll be so much better. I wanted to tell you guys about a series that I want to do and it'll be in my playlist and it's one on, um, remember I told everybody I last year I made all kinds of stuff for my kids for Christmas and I put it in a Actually, I put it in a, um apple, those apple bucket things, and I'm going to do the same thing this year because they really did like everything, and so I thought I'm going to do it again, and when I make something up, I want to bring you guys along with me so that maybe you can get some ideas on what to make for your families, because... You know, especially now when we're trying to stock up our food and do all those things, I think it would be nice to have something that they can throw, you know, in really quick, like the um, cookies or cake mixes, or I make a killer hot chocolate, um, queso, all that good stuff. So I'm going to make a list of the things I'm going to do, and then I haven't thought of the name for it yet, but it's going to be prepped for the um, presents I'm going to make my kids. So let me get this browned up, then we'll come back when I get to the burgers. I'll see you guys in a minute. Alright, so I'm back. The hamburgers are done, and actually what I put on them, on both sides, was my hamburger seasoning. And um, what I do is, I patty mine up, and then I take my... Um, I take called the air taker router, and then I can always have four hamburgers at ready anytime I need them. So, I'm going to turn it this way. It's going to be hard for you to see anything, but I put all my stuff in this bowl, and I'm going to put it on top of the hamburgers now. And I'm going to load it up, you guys, seriously. These are going to be amazing. So, on top of every burger, there's going to be mushrooms, onions, um, my little peppers, and pepperoni. Oh, 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 this is going to be so good. And I'm making a mess of my stove. Nothing unusual. Making a mess of my floor. Nothing unusual. <laughs> Alrighty, there's some that's actually 
in the pan that fell off too. So now I want to put mozzarella cheese on it. Because you can't have pizza without mozzarella cheese, right? These are going to be so yummy. Anything pizza is always yummy. You know what I mean? Like, I love pizza. For a long time, I made pizza for a living. And I still loved it. <laughs> Alright, so, with my buns here, let me push you out a little bit so maybe you can see something. Alright, so with my buns, what I'm going to do is... I'm going to put pizza sauce on the top and on the bottom. I'm not a real saucy person, but you know, really you're not getting that much sauce when you do this. So I'm going to do tops and bottoms. Just talked to Tom. He stopped and picked our stuff up at the auction place and he should be home soon. That's good because I'm starving. I don't look like it, do I? <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to put on them all these. I think these will be amazing. I've never actually made them before, so this is a new thing for me too. I constantly look for new things because, you know, there's only so many times I can cook the same stuff over and over again. So I want new content for you guys. So if I make it again and again, obviously it's something I really, really like. So, and my lid of course is missing again. What the heck? So we'll just use my fry pan. Tom will put those my other pan away. <laughs> I don't know where he puts it. So we'll put that over top of it so that the cheese can melt. My potatoes are done. And I use my black pan, whatever that stuff is called, about the third time I've cooked in it. Chelsea will be happy to see the video tonight and see that I use my cast iron. I had bought a cast iron set when I was young. It was not a pretty picture. <laughs> Because if you don't properly maintain it, it's probably not a good thing. Not at all. Because they rust and everything else. So, yeah. So while that's melting, I am going to... Get my potatoes put on the plates. I probably put more butter in there than I needed to, too, but... I'm getting used to it. It'll take a minute. All right. The one thing I do have found with this cast iron is, boy, does it make stuff so much crispier. And I like a crispy potato. And then I pack some in Tom's lunch, too. Because whatever I make that night, he takes the next day for work. So anything left over, that's Tom's lunch. Alrighty. Got that part done. Now, let's see what these look like. Almost melted. Almost. So, um, if there's something that you guys would like to see me make, let me know. If there's, um, even if it's like a Christmas thing or something like that, let me know. If it's something I can do, I'll try it. Um, I am going to start prepping for Christmas, obviously. <laughs> I have uh, three boys and they all have families and, <coughs> excuse me. I've got two blankets to make for my grandsons, so I've got to get stuff started. Just a couple more minutes. 
But um, make sure that you guys like, share, and subscribe. Um, share it with your friends. Let them know I'm wild and crazy and stupid. <laughs> they might enjoy it. <laughs> but Jack's not here today because I'm trying to make him be more responsible so that he has to actually cook for himself on certain days. I offered to do the hamburger thing with him today, and he, he didn't want to walk back to get in the freezer. So he did. But I'm like, he has to learn to start becoming, you know, a little bit more so he can take care of stuff himself. Because if you leave it up to him, he won't cook. <laughs> All right. Turn off our heat. This looks good, you guys. Oh, ho, ho. Let's put some bun on top of that real quick. There's one, and look at all that ooey gooey cheese. All right, let's dish up Tom's here. And I'll leave the top off of it so you guys can see it. This is going to be an ooey gooey mess, which is fine. I happen to like ooey gooey messes. So, these are the hamburgers. Don't they look delish? So when he gets here, I'll have him taste test this stuff and see what his what his idea is, if he likes it or not. And by the way, he will tell you if he doesn't like something. I forgot to always tell you guys that. You'll get that ugly look and <laughs> you know he doesn't like it. But I'll be back and let the kahuna try it. All right, and there's the kahuna. He's going to try the pizza burger. What do you think, Tom? Tastes like a pizza burger. You've never had a pizza burger, so how do you know? Oh, it tastes like pizza and burger. <laughs> good, good? Bad? It's awesome. Would you try it again? Mm -hmm. Take another bite. We got to know because you didn't look so sure about it. I said one bite, not two. <laughs> so, Kahuna approved. Kahuna approved. Say goodbye, Tom. Goodbye, Tom. You guys have a blessed night and be a blessing.